all the cars coming by and it's quite loud. Uh, there's a funny story, this is the third time I've videoed this video, purely because I had the camera this way and not this way. So in the previous two videos, all you've got is forehead, 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 and I can tell you I wouldn't want to look at that. So um, yeah, this video is about a new app I found, and it is called Be Livery. Be Livery. So the app is a little bit like Amazon Flex, um, but instead of parcels, you're doing people shopping for them. So people um, they order shopping on the app with the same name. And when they ordered their shopping, drivers locally to them will get a ping or a notification uh, with a price that you're going to get for the delivery and a list of the stuff you need to buy. Um, once you've collected the shopping, you take it to the customer, you pay for it yourself on your own card, and then you get reimbursed by the company the following day, as well as you get paid for the block. Not the block, but the shopping trip you've done. Uh, really simple. I downloaded it a couple of weeks ago and it, um, you get a few pings here and there but it's never been uh, any close enough for me to think oh I'll go and do that. But yesterday I was out doing my own shopping and um, one came in very close to where I was shopping like three miles away. So um, I left it for a minute to see whether anyone else was going to take it and no one did so I thought Although the money was like only for like, it was like £9 or £10 and some change. I thought for the, you know, to see how it goes, I'm going to do it. So I did the shopping yesterday, really simple. You're going around the shop with the app, with your phone in your hand, obviously. You get uh, all the products and then you type in the cost of each product onto the app that you're buying it for. Um, Very simple. And then when you've come to the checkout, obviously you pay for it yourself, reimburse the next day. You take it to the customer. Uh, on the app, you keep the receipt. You don't give the receipt to the customer. It's quite important and it does specify it a couple of times on the app when you're doing the delivery. Uh, you get to keep it for your own records and you take a picture of it through the app and send it to the company. So they know you, you're not lying when you're saying bananas cost £5 for a bunch and it only costs £2 or something. I don't know, this sort of thing. Uh, yeah, um, and I found with this, it was quite cool because the customers are really grateful for what you're doing because maybe they can't get out or they usually do home online shopping for groceries, but all the blocks are full because of the virus. So it's the only other way they have to get their stuff. So I found when I did mine yesterday, the woman was very grateful for the service that I provided. Not as dressed either because you haven't got like 48 parcels or something to do. You're just focusing on one person shopping at that point of time, irrespective of the money. I did another one this morning because one popped up when I was on my run and I got like uh, £20 and you actually get a bonus which is quite cool. So if you do the, um, if you do, if you deliver the shopping by a certain time, you get an increased bonus and it's usually like one or two pounds more which helps a bit, you know. you got to think that's like half your petrol if it's you know a few miles down the road so mine was today i swiped on twitter about 9 20 i believe it was and the challenge or the bonus was that if you got it there before 10 past 10 you got a uh, one or two pound increase in your pay uh, i did and i got a bonus which is quite cool for that one i got paid about 19 or 20 pounds so um yeah quite a bit of a higher yield one but i'd really recommend the app especially because now i found out that you can have you can only do amazon flex consecutively six days on the seventh day you have to have a day off from it irrespective of how many hours you've done for amazon flex so if you want something to do on that day off a little another side gig or maybe um maybe if you finish your block early and you still want to make some money you've got that option too so yeah uh, quite cool i quite like it um Although it's not a very busy app, you can get what you want from it, you know. Sometimes you get them at four in the morning, but I haven't done that because I, I don't need to do it that much. But yeah, if you want to get out and about as well, or maybe if you're doing your own shopping and it pops up, you can do two things, with what, you know, two, kill two birds with one stone, which is great because then you're practically pay, being paid to do your own shopping as well. So all these really good points that I think about the app. Oh uh, yeah, I really would recommend you download it. The more people know about it and the more people... Um, the more reliable the app is for people and the more people I would say will use it so definitely one to download irrespective if you live in a town or a city it's nationwide there's no um, there's no um, location specific places it's all um, all everywhere all um, 
nationwide, like I said. So yeah, I'd really recommend this one. Uh, please like this video if you found it useful or interesting. Uh, please subscribe if you like it even more or if you're cool. And uh, please comment if you think it's... Um, no, if you've got any comments for me or any questions about the app or Amazon Flex or anything else, please comment so I can make these videos better. For years, I've always said I wanted to do a YouTube channel about my normal job. And uh, now I've been furloughed from that for three months and I've got time to do a YouTube channel. I thought I'd do about this instead. So yeah, um, thank you guys. Have a great rest of the day. Enjoy the sun if it's sunny where you are.